Good afternoon everyone, Stacy with Heartland Scoot Boots and today I wanted to give you a quick introduction into the boot that everybody's really excited about, the new addition to our product line called the Scoot Enduro. As you can see, the boot shell itself is identical to the traditional strap-on boot. This boot will require mud straps for the correct performance and as a result Scoot Boot is going to be including several different sizes of mud straps in with your purchase of this new Enduro to ensure that you have the correct size that's going to work for your horse. The big difference in this design is when we go to the heel and instead of having the fixed heel strap we're all familiar with, now we have basically what's an adjustable heel strap. It's soft and flexible and can be adjusted to accommodate higher heels or low heels. Um, basically any kind of heel that has previously been um, unable to be accommodated by the traditional strap-on scoop boots. So in simple terms, what has happened is we've designed this rear collar that's integrated into um, what looks very similar to the pastern strap in the scoop boot. And this rear collar actually allows that mud strap to be threaded through, keeping it in the correct position so that the mud strap is the primary means of retention on this boot. This can be adjusted up or down as needed to accommodate the height of this heel. This piece right here is called the extension and it is not gonna be something that is necessary for all, for all horses, but I am including it in this video because these are how the boots will come. This extension I think is gonna be quite handy on horses that have a lower heel that this strap will want to ride further down on the heel bulbs than it should. So this extender is gonna help keep that strap high enough on the heels. The snugness, we want this to be snug, but we also want to be able to get our finger in the back of it, just like the traditional scoop boots. The length and snugness can be adjusted on both sides by this particular knob. Um, there's several holes. There's also a hole so you can change the positioning if needed for a horse that has really upright heels or maybe mules. And basically what you're gonna do is fit this so you have the correct snugness and position. You're gonna use probably a little bit of clear nail polish or low strength Loctite on the screws on both sides. And then if you have some excess, you can just trim that off. And that way this boot will be set up for this particular horse. The mud strap snugness is gonna be similar to the mud strap snugness that you see now. You're gonna to wanna to be able to get one finger in there. You're gonna want it to be snug. Also, a good key is if you just see just a slight amount of space right behind that front collar, you'll know that it's snug enough to keep that boot on, yet not too tight to cause problems. You can also use the mud strap sleeves if you would like. If you have any questions about these boots, please, please give me a shout and I'll try to answer them for you as well as I can. And I'm really looking forward to getting some of these out on the trail so I can give you my review on them. Thanks and have a great day.